emotions running high tonight inside Muncie City Hall as Indiana Michigan Power customers make their case against plans to hike up their electricity rates, many of them elderly, on fixed income, and struggling to make ends meet. Financially, it messed me up. Viola Boyd is 71, living on Social Security and ready to fight. I'm a senior citizen. You know? She's one of hundreds of INM customers at a public hearing Monday here to object to the nearly 20% rate hike their power company is requesting. We have an obligation to keep the lights on, keep the costs affordable. The increase would give Indiana Michigan Power a more than $250 million increase in operating revenues. That's a $25 hike for the average customer. Things are high as it is. Everybody's on fixed income. Everything's closed around here. A lot of people are not working. The fixed monthly residential customer charge would go from seven dollars 30 cents to 18 dollars the monthly service charge for most small business customers would rise from nine dollars 70 cents to 19 dollars we realize any increase for any customer is seen as potentially a problem INM says it needs the money to keep up with rising expenses and to pay for capital improvements we're replacing miles of overhead line in this proposal as well as substation improvements but some customers call it a bailout for bad business decisions it's not fair for for us to have to pay for people's mistakes. If approved, the rate hike would come in two phases next July and January 2019. And I don't want to have to sacrifice my heat. Now, there is still time to submit your comments to the State Office of Utility Consumer Counselor. Those comments, though, due by this Thursday, November 2nd. Reporting in Muncie, Matthew McClellan, RTV6.